Hey guys, how's it going? My name is Alejandro, also known as Revel, the speed painter. But today I'm actually going to be your art instructor and I'm gonna show you how to paint a simple, beautiful Star Wars themed painting in under five minutes. Because let's be honest, who doesn't love Star Wars and who doesn't have five minutes nowadays? You know, it's making me miss my barber quite a lot, looking pretty rough. But hopefully watching this art is all over and if not, well, hopefully you're staying home, being safe. But uh, but without further ado, let's go ahead and get you guys painting super fast, like Usain Bolt fast, okay? So the first thing you're gonna want is your canvas. So a nice horizontal canvas, just like that. You want a water cup and two brushes, a big brush and a little brush for details. And put that in the water to get it ready. Yellow, red, blue, white, and black acrylic paint. And we're going to want a napkin to dry off our brush. So we're going to start off with our big brush first. Load it up with yellow paint on both sides of the brush. And we're going to start off with some nice, long, horizontal strokes from the top down as we do the background. And we want to really get an even coverage a third of the way down with that yellow. Now we're going to get three scoops of yellow and about one scoop of red to get a nice little orange color. And mix that nice and evenly on your palette. We're gonna take that, we're gonna drag that paint across the yellow border at the bottom there, just like that, and we're gonna dry it off so that we can blend it. So dry off your brush with a napkin, now with the dry brush, just start blending where the two colors meet so you form a gradient, back and forth, nice long strokes. Now take that orange, and you're gonna go down about halfway down the canvas. Nice long strokes, really drag that paint across. If you gotta get more paint on there, get more paint on your brush until you get a nice even distribution of paint. Now we're going to make some like a light red pink color almost. Two scoops of red, one scoop of white. We're going to mix that evenly on your brush and we're going to we're going to do the same step. We're going to take that red and drag it across the bottom of the orange. Dry it off. And we're going to blend the red with the orange just like that. And we're going to take that red all the way down to the bottom of that sky uh, background. All right, let that dry for about 5 minutes. Come back and we're going to make the sand dunes in the foreground with about three scoops of red and then one scoop of blue just to make it a little more purplish and maybe a little bit more red and we're gonna start from the bottom portion there beneath the red horizon down to the bottom left corner almost and we're gonna fill that curved line beneath it to form that that shape and then we're gonna get a little bit of black and add it to that same color just to make it a little bit darker maybe a touch of blue and um, maybe a little bit more black in there just to make it darker and we're gonna add it right underneath that color we just added that's still wet and it kind of blended in a little bit okay now we're gonna do another sand dune behind this one with more red just plain red though this time okay and it's gonna be a curved line that kind of shoots out like that to the right and then fill, make sure you get that nice crisp edge there at the bottom. Now go ahead and clean off your brushes. We're gonna start off with a little brush for details as we do the spaceships. So at the top right hand corner, we're gonna get some black paint, reload it up really nicely. And we're gonna just do a little circle. So just find a little spot there, do some circle, do a little circle shape just like so. And we're gonna get a, hor a diagonal line cutting across that circle like that. We're gonna make it a little bit thicker. So this is going to represent kind of like the body, the chassis of the spaceship there where the wings are going to fall under. So for the wings, it's just two parallel lines that kind of follow the shape there like that of where the, the, the lines are going. And it's going to be almost like a, like a triangular shape there that cuts in, not, not a perfectly straight line. And we're going to do two more little spaceships in the background. The further out they get, the smaller they get. Right, so we're gonna start with the figure now. It's gonna cut into the sand dune like that. That's gonna represent the body. We're gonna do a little cross shape to represent where the arms go. And now we're gonna do a little circle for the head. And maybe a little bit of flicks of paintbrush, of paint, of black paint to represent hair. And it's a silhouette, very simple. Do the torso, the oval shape. Now we're gonna do the hips with another circular shape. And we're gonna leave room there for the, the leg behind that that other leg and then the arm maybe have the skirt kind of flowing in the wind another little arm and the staff kind of connecting with that arm down to where her her feet are I'm going to build that a little bit more just get a little bit more definition again it doesn't have to be perfect 
just a silhouette. Again, this is a very simple beginner painting. Um, and we're gonna get the feet in there. Uh, it looks like I made a little boo-boo there. But hey, there's no mistakes in art, only happy accidents, right? So we're gonna, you, if, you make, if you mess up, cool thing is you can just paint right over it. So I could paint right over that with some, some red paint. And then we're gonna make the shadows here. Just some black paint, kind of blend that in just a little bit. All right, awesome. Clean off your brush really well, and we're gonna make the suns with white paint. Okay, just white, and I'm gonna take a little bit of the same orange we used earlier in the beginning, and we're gonna create almost like these little clouds in the in front of the, the, the sun there, just by dragging it across gently. And that pretty much wraps it up, guys. Don't forget to sign your masterpiece. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please give it a like. That'd be much appreciated. Uh, I'm gonna be giving away this painting for free. Just all you gotta do is, is like, leave a comment, and I'll pick somebody, and I'll get that to you as soon as possible. Thank you so much.